And now storm tracker weather with meteorologist Paul Bean. All right, let's take a quick look at those flood warnings that are still throughout the region. This one until 5 p.m. We're finally starting to wane off some of these flooding warnings in the Chalice Mackey in the Central Mountain area. That's going to start to make its way out. Those river levels are going down and we're starting to see an improvement. Port Niff River still seeing that flood warning as well, but once again heading down 9.1 right now with the feet above that flood stage of 8.5, but it's expected to be below flood stage by Thursday. So just in a few more days, we'll start to see an improvement on the Port Neuf River and the Bear River still seeing that warning as well. Very small region, but still almost a foot over fl uh, flood stage 8.4 where that flood stage is 7.5. So we are seeing all these rivers start to lower. We haven't seen any severe rain, although as we saw in the, the storm tracker a little bit earlier, it is on its way. We're seeing a little more rain and it's scattering its way in right now. We've seen lightning strikes already all the way past Pocatello starting to move in our direction. Tonight it's going to be a little dicey. We're going to see this rain move through. We're going to see some thunder strikes here and there. And then as we move into tomorrow, expect it to start to wane off in the morning hours. And then finally, by around the peak of the day, we're going to see a lot of that moisture gone. Because as we zoom out, we still see it's a pretty isolated system. This system's the one we're looking at right now. But as we move it through towards closer to the evening, we are going to see that start to scatter out. We are going to see that start to move out. And we're going to start to see those temperatures go up as a result. That rain's gone, sun's out. See that warm temperatures make their way back in almost spring-like weather. Future Tracker seeing a lot of that scatter out. And around, you can see that 6 to 7 p.m. tomorrow, we're going to be completely clear. And into tomorrow night, expect to see clouds still in the area. But for the most part, all that rain is going to move out. And now as we move into tonight, that scattered moisture is going to stick around. Lightning strikes here and there, 43 in Pocatello, 41 in Idaho Falls. So it does still get down into those colder temperatures. But for tonight in the Central Mountains, seeing more of that rain, 39 in Chalice, 39 in Salmon. Highlands in Western Wyoming, nighttime rain, 34 in Island Park, 31 in Jackson. But as we move around to tomorrow, it starts to clear out. 61 in Island Park, 61 in Jackson. For the Central Mountains, that rain scatters out as well. A little bit warmer, though, 69 there in Chalice. And then finally, for the Snake River Plain, still seeing those thunderstorms roll through still. But it will clear out as we move into the evening hours. 71 in Pocatello, 69 in Idaho Falls. Now, as we take a quick look at those seven day forecasts, Pocatello, like I said, pushing that rain out tomorrow. We're getting done with the rain for a little bit at the very least. We see that sun move in. And then check out those temperatures 74 on Monday, 78 on Tuesday, 79 on Wednesday. And it does cool down a little bit when that rain comes back in. But for the most part, seeing more of those spring like weather. We're kind of done with that snow and winter rain mix that we saw this last week. Idaho Falls, same deal that break Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and temperatures were warming up all the way into the low 80s. As we move over to the Teton area, we do see a little bit thunderstorm as well, but we see that break Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday through Saturday. We see that rain as well. And then finally for the Central Mountains, seeing it break on Monday and then all the way until Wednesday, we're going to have that chance of rain. So it's going to be nice because we have seen that winter weather make a return, but now as we move forward, we are starting to see that sun and 80s come back. It's going to be a beautiful week, Definitely. except a little bit of rain tomorrow. That's yeah. okay. All right. <laughs> Heavy rain.